Hi. It's 9 p.m. Well, it's almost 9 p.m. It's not quite 9 p.m. And we're uh, we're video gaming. We're we're gonna be playing some Celeste, some Celeste B sides. Uh, I'm pretty excited. We haven't done bundle games in a while. I want to go back and actually just do bundle games. Like, don't get me wrong, I like Celeste. I've been playing Celeste for a while though. Well, I that's a lie. I haven't been playing Celeste for a while. I I have been on Celeste as a bundle game for a very long time, <clears throat> partially just due to like moving and life and i'm sure you're tired of hearing excuses the point is we're here now we're playing celeste yeah let's get into it i hope everyone's having a decent night i did stream earlier today i streamed some rim world it's a pretty intense stream i screamed a lot i made a lot of noise we're gonna be chill this stream uh mostly because my voice probably can't take another like chatty stream <laughs> but i hope all of you are doing well um Man, what to even talk about? I was actually... It was a strange thing to talk about. I was thinking about... Um, tattoos earlier today, because my friend was asking about it. I mentioned in the past that I want to get a tattoo, and... I have a really big one that I want to get. But they were like, oh, you should get a smaller one to start off with, which is a very good piece of advice, obviously, because, like, you know... To don't get a freaking wait did I do this one hold on how do I know if I've done a b-side I think if I have the heart right I think I've done this one so that means it's time for b-side of celestial resort which might be a thing remember not liking this level normally hold on do that real quick I have to remember how to actually play this game. Uh, this looks... Uh-huh. Uh okay, what is over here? Gonna raid you, but got burnt out. Still to the last checkpoint in 6PG. Nice. Hey. As is life. I've been seeing that a lot recently. Hold on. I'm gonna fucking... Okay, that's a thing. There's a thing over here. That's a shame. How do I how do I do this? I did it like perfectly the first time. I don't even know how I did that. Oh, there we go. Th is this possible? Any tips for streaming for longer? Usually I can only go for an hour max and then I crumple. Hold on. This music is so loud. It's very good, but it's very loud. Um, I don't actually have any amazing tips for streaming longer. I think best advice I can give you is just, like, you're just going to have to get used to it. Um, if you find yourself getting burnt out in an hour, then that is your body telling you that you need to stand up for, like, ten minutes stretch drink some water like walk around not stare at your screen for like cut straight so like if you're getting burnt out at the hour mark that means that you need to get up for like 10 minutes just say hey i'm gonna take a quick break uh i recommend everyone do the same walk around drink some water like i just said some viewers are definitely gonna like jump ship when you do that sure but like it's probably good for you like, whenever I do a longer stream, I usually take a break, like, halfway through, just because otherwise, you know, I can't really do it. So, hold on. I I'm guessing, is this anything, or am I, like, wasting everyone's time by trying to make this jump? I also don't really know how to do this. I haven't done... I haven't done any Celeste in a very long time, and I haven't done this in a even longer time. I'm like doing like a half wave dash. Oh, there we go. But how did I get the... How did I get the... The wave dash where I kept the... Kept the, the, the thingy. Hey, Koshak, how are you? I'm gonna go this way for now. And then maybe we'll go look at that later. Huh. Hold on. 
But yeah, I'd, I'd recommend just taking a break, like halfway through the stream. You don't have to go for a uh, freaking, like, two hours straight. You can take like a ten minute break in the middle. No one's gonna blame you for not wanting to destroy your knees, like mine are probably being destroyed. Dang it. Hold on. Fuck! I have been tricked. I've been j jokestered. Oh, wait, you can just do that? Okay. Okay. I literally don't have to jump into it. I feel very silly now. Hold on. Maybe if I, like... Okay, I see how it is. Okay, I got this. I can do this. <laughs> oh, I, I, I get it. Like, I'm understanding it, but it's like... It's rough. Hold on. Okay. Oh, I like, I like almost have it. Okay, that was really good. If I had the like, dash still. Okay, I think I get this. Oh, okay. I can do this. I can totally do this. Not like that, though. Hmm. <laughs> <gasps> Got it. Okay. N no. What? Uh. Okay. I don't... Hold on, the phone's coming out again. I'm taking a picture of it. This is probably going to be relevant at some point. Alright. Yep, yep, yep. Alright. It is blue, yellow, blue, blue. Okay. No, hold on, I should be... Can I, like... Can I, like, do a... Hmm. No, I gotta, I gotta do it like this. That's fine. Oi! Well, okay. <gasps> I don't know why I did that one. There's gonna be a lot of noises today. Hope everyone's ready for a noise stream. A noise band stream. Someone can probably sample my voice and make a deep fake by now, just by the amount of content that I've put out. I'm not super happy about that, but you know. Oh. Oh well. Okay. Um. <laughs> Congratulations. That's the worst that anyone's done it, little buddy. Fuck! Okay. I had it though. I, my brain did function for a moment there. But a moment. Y'all saw the neurons fire. It, it, there was at least one activation of a neuron in my head. None of you can deny that. Stop. Why do I keep doing that? I forget my... I get like ketchup IQ whenever I have these moving things. They remind me of those like donut guys in Super Mario World. I, or rather they're on the donut like platform level. 
tabbing in and out of stream because I'm cyber grinding. What the fuck is cyber grinding? No, wait, maybe don't tell me. That sounds intimate and personal. Cyber grinding absolutely sounds like VR sex. Just throwing that out there. Oh, Ultra Kill Infinite. Never mind, it's just a video game. If someone walked up to me and said that they were cyber grinding, I would assume that it is VR headset. Like, like ERP. I would not assume that it's like gameplay. Okay. Okay, we're fine. This one's rough. Darn. That's probably a way to do it though. You know what another way of doing this actually is? Probably... Not that. <laughs> I can't believe I discovered attack. I'm a genius. Look how genius I am. Look how massive and beautiful and, like, lovely my mind is. All of you are, are bearing witness to a, like, Michelin star intelligence here. <laughs> Do you really think someone that's, whose arrow ace would tab out of E6 to watch this fucking stream? Damn, okay, fuck. I thought my content was okay. I don't know if it's that good. Darn. That's just life. <laughs> Excellent. Great job. <gasps> okay. Oh, that's real bad. I guess I'll have to do the, the funny route now. Oh. Funny not achieved. <gasps> Fuck. That's enough ultra kill for the minute. No, keep ultra killing. Ultra kill everything. It's called ultra kill. It's not called ultra spare. It's not called ultra... Revive. Hmm. <gasps> okay. That's possible. It's just very hard. I think I'm getting it, though. I think I'm understanding the tech. Oh. I didn't have enough momentum on that one. I feel like I have to point down when I do the dash. Oh, I totally do. Okay. You actual piece of shit. That is such a... That's unnecessary. I'm sorry, video game. That's fucking stupid. I, I don't mean to be a, a... A like, oh, the game sucks. That was fucking stupid, though. That should not have been a thing. Oh, congratulations. You made this really hard jump. Fuck you. It's like, oh, thanks. I guess video game. Cool. It's funny because like I, every single person that I've talked to hated this level normally, and now that I'm doing it like remix version, I'm not doing the intended route. Intend this. <laughs> All right. Yeah, maybe you have a point. You all have my permission to clip that, and if anyone ever asks what this stream is like, <laughs> just send them that clip. <laughs> I'll be saying, intend this, and then eating just the biggest shit in the world. <laughs> Why don't you intend these? <laughs> Intended route? Okay. <laughs> That's awful. I'm so sorry. Why don't any of you watch me? <laughs> oh, I... Man, I really... I chickened out on that one. Oh. I had the flow state for a half second there. It felt real good. <laughs> Why did I chicken out again? I keep on chickening out. What am I? Some kind of... Poultry? Some kind of delectable meal. Looking like a snack. <laughs> this feels like fighting game inputs after a certain point. I'll be perfectly honest. 
This is from someone who's really bad at fighting games. This game kind of feels like a fighting game. I'm doing like quarter circles, half circles. I will say, uh, game night, community game night, game night this week ended up being like, uh, I think Gardic phone, which is really surprising. Darn. I should just do the regular route. I just really don't want to do it because I'm, uh, I'm a coward. I didn't know it was going to follow me. I'm really glad that I made this. There still isn't a clips channel. Oh, I probably should do that. Ah, I just put it in Drek. <laughs> um, I'm thinking. I'm thinking about the route that I must take. That was it. That was the route. Perfect route. Double the... Even better. Did you see that? She's fucking gaming? Ugh. I'm fucking gaming. Oh! <gasps> okay. Hold on, I'm gonna get like this normally. Okay. Oh. Why did I do that? What motivation did I have? <gasps> I don't know what I grabbed onto there, but apparently I could <laughs> jump over it. <laughs> okay, listen, let's, let's, let's not continue doing that. As funny as that is... You salty dog. Yeah. Everything's fine. Okay, we gotta get gotta get one of these. Yeah. Do you think you'd be interested in the multiplayer mod thing for this game? It's really easy to set up about three minutes. Possibly? I think that'd be a pretty fun game night thing too. Oh, do I have to, like, do I need the, the jump for this one? I think I need the jump for this one. Oh, I don't know why I didn't grab onto the ledge there. That was strange. <gasps> oh, that was my fault. Oh, I, I almost had it there, actually. If I would have gone a little bit further around that thingy, I could have, um, well, not done that. I could have just jumped like a freak. <gasps> Fuck you. All right, I'm the best. This is very important. We're actually building up momentum by doing this. It also is vibrating my hands really nicely, and this is actually really... This feels really nice on my hands. Mm. Ah, okay. What am I gonna do here? I could just, like... Oh, I think I have to get the, 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 the bingles. <laughs> Thanks? I, I literally dead. Oh, my controller died. Chef's kiss. I was like, I dashed. I'm pretty sure I dashed, and then my character wouldn't respond. I was like, uh, it's all skeletons in it. <laughs> Controller user. Oh, okay. Sorry. I'll do this then. What's, he, what's even the fucking? No, don't do that. What's the dash button? X. All right. Fine. There. I'm doing it. <laughs> How am I? I'm actually doing pretty good. 
How do I... How do I... How do I... How do you jump? C? Okay, how do I grab? D? Are you kidding me? Alright, here we go. The controller is just vibrating my fucking dick now, so that's gonna be fun. <laughs> okay, no, I'm not doing that. I'm using the controller. <laughs> I'm doing okay, actually. How are you, Cap Rival? Hope you're doing well. We're playing a little bit of Celeste. We're doing B-side. Eh. Wast, J to dash, and K to climb. I, uh... I don't know what I'm doing. I'm, I'm just hitting buttons sometimes, and sometimes they do what I want them to do. <laughs> sometimes they do what I want them to do. I'm good. Got my only ped day of the year tomorrow. Ped day? What is a ped day? I'm guessing that's like a... Like an, a paid vacation day or something? <sighs> Dang it. Day off of school. Ah... Uh, fair. Fair and fair. Oh, schooling. I, uh, I wouldn't mind going back to college and, um, getting a degree in... I think mycology is probably what I'd, I'd get a degree in. I know that sounds like the lamest thing in the world. Maybe just, like, botany in general. I I'd like to do that. I'd actually really like to get a botany degree. <laughs> wow, the trans girl wants a botany degree. What else is fucking new? Wow. You're so unique and special. <laughs> Sorry. I just really like it when people make fun of each other's majors. Because it's like... It's, just, it's such a stupid thing to make fun of. I don't know. Go! Oh. Yeah. Oh, I'm a genius. Look at my brain. It's fucking swelling. Major in Subnautica game mechanics. Well, honestly... Like, w that picture of, like, the really crusty butler tipping their hat that says respect. Major in Isaac item descriptions also respect. <laughs> Holy shit, I didn't know we had such a, like... I didn't know my stream attracted, like, the smartest people in the fucking world. Because I don't understand either of those things. So, honestly, respect. Okay, I don't know what we're doing here. Uh, apparently the game just wanted us to go, though, so... Here we fucking go. Ow. Geometry dash lore. What the fuck? Security! <laughs> Name an item, I'll tell you what it does. What does the sausage do in Binding of Isaac? Tell me. Tell me. What does the sausage do? Isn't the lore of Geometry Dash that there's shapes and they they dash? Oh! Ow! 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 Just have to keep on barking like a dog, I guess. Revy would be very proud of me if she hopped in the stream and heard me. I don't even know how I fucked that up as badly as I did. That was very impressive. I thought it would bounce me. Sumimasen, yo necesito. Yo necesito un spaghetti biru. Qu'est-ce Sausage is an item that is general all set up, but more than just all stats. Just being devil angel chance and added 6.9. That's so strange. Okay, um, what does... 
uh, Monstro's Tooth do? Okay, Subnautica question. All right, uh, what color is the peeper in Subnautica? Tell me. Kin to the High Priestess card. Okay, alright. That's an easy one. It's time for the hardest item description in the game. Uh, what is Brother Bobby's actual name? No Googling. Okay, I, I don't know why I thought if I dashed up the, the button would also bounce me. I'm gonna cry. What the fuck? <laughs> the peeper is dark gray. It consists of yellow iris with black pupil. The peeper's cousin, the oculus, is a lighter gray with pink iris. I thought the peeper was blue. Oh, I'm thinking of the boomerang. Never mind, you're right. I'm gonna vomit. The vomit is coming out of my mouth. You can probably all hear it. When do I get the Celeste gun that lets me shoot these dust bunnies? Is Brother Bobby's real name just Bob? No, it's actually Brother. It's pretty fucked up. <sighs> There's a mod for that, it's called Gunline. <laughs> of course there is. Ah. <sighs> uh. Given the opportunity, I'd probably kill Mr. Ashiro at this point. I know that they're a ghost. I'd still probably kill them at this point. <laughs> Firearms aren't standard equipment for mountain climbing. It depends where you are from. I... Ah, Jackie... I want to watch Jackie Chan Adventures again. And see the grandpa give sagely advice. It's rocket jump. <laughs> yeah, before stairs were invented, they were. The strongest American writer, Shakespeare Cleese. I'm gonna vomit, like... Ugh. What do you mean? What do you mean the pizza's boneless? I ordered a fucking bone-in pizza. I ordered so many sardines on my fucking pizza, bro. I fucking love sardines. Oh, okay, we're up here now. That's good. You know what? Let's just play some Faster Than Light. Wouldn't that be fun? Just some good old Faster Than Light. Instead of Mr. Oshiro's House of Fun. Probably pronouncing his name wrong, too. I don't actually remember what his name was. I just know he was a ghost. And he had a green shirt, I think? Okay, everything... Eto. Kya. Mr. Oshito. Is it Mr. Oshito? I thought it was an art. Maybe I read it wrong. I don't know. I don't actually know what their name is. I'm gonna die. It is Mr. Oshiro. Oh, okay. Or Mr. Oshiro, perhaps. Perhaps the eye is spoken and not seen. Wow, I... Congratulations, you failed successfully? I don't know what I did there. Oh. All of, what do you mean, all of... I'm trying my best. I'm literally doing everything in my power to beat this fucking part of the stage. It's just not good. My power is not maximum.
<laughs> I don't want to be here. <laughs> oh, all right. Yeah, 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 yeah. reach a checkpoint and play 4B. No, I'm not doing that again. <laughs> I'm not falling for that again. Just reach a checkpoint. It'll be fine. I promise. <laughs> okay. Hmm. Cool. Alright. What's that supposed to mean? I don't know what it's supposed to mean. I'm just scared. I'm gonna die. <laughs> uh. Oh, you're leaving? Okay, goodbye. Farewell. Oh, you're not leaving. That was you're, you're talking about one of the levels in the video game, Celeste. I hate you, bottom of the screen. Can't you just be like one centimeter further down? That'd be pretty based. What? What? <laughs> Why can't I have my double jump? Isn't Gothme still my friend at this point? Oh wait, they're not my friend yet. Right. I don't have a goth GF inside me yet. Even though it's me. I don't know if I should... Mm, I shouldn't make those jokes. Ah. Hmm. Wah, 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 wah. Ah, uh, mm, mm-hmm. I would like this, please. Go away. I Flashback to when my hair was dyed blue. I don't think I'm ever gonna dye my hair. Actually, it's a lie. I kinda wanna dye it black. I just, I don't wanna dye my hair because I don't know, I don't know how much hair I have left in terms of like, how long it's gonna last. Because I know that my family has not great hair. I think I think the funny pills have have stopped the hair loss. Who knows? Could be wrong. Okay. <laughs> Don't die it. Yeah, see that's the thing. Well, you can dye your hair in this video game. I might do that. I don't know what color I'd dye my hair as in the video game, Celeste, for the N64. I hate... There's a corner kick? I don't know what that is. Super easy to set up that mod, but I have the itch.io version. I don't have Steam Workshop. Oh! Huh. Actual mod launcher? Oh, scary. And it works with something? Did you just, what would you just type in here? Did you just type a slur in my chat? I'll have you banned, you know. Okay. Oh, Olympus. All right, hold on. Oh, it's .io with the spaces, I see. Right, there's no links. Look, I was told to block. I was told to keep links blocked, and I'm gonna keep that as a thing because I'm scared. I mean, I could just ban people if they put fucked up links in chat. Like, I don't know. If someone clearly puts like a Pornhub link, it's like, yeah, okay. Like, no one's falling for that. Okay, 
How, how do I not die here? Question. <laughs> Clearly not like that. That's the correct way to not die there. Just do that. <laughs> Why? Why did I... <laughs> My tea is cold. <laughs> Hold on. Funny cat video. Oh yes, Wet Pussy 7, my favorite funny cat video. Ugh, I hate that word so much, dude. I don't know why. Such a just awful word. I, uh, this might be a very weird thing to talk about on stream, so you know what? I'm not gonna talk about it. Because it will, it will encourage people to put things in chat that I don't want to see in chat. So we're not gonna have this conversation. Good talk, me. Good job, me. Why did I do that? What is wrong with me? <laughs> I hate this. I hate this stage. I hate these funny dust bunnies. Alright, fucking... No time to think. Oh god, oh god, okay, everything's fine. Fuck you, alright. Disney posted a trailer for the Owl House finale three weeks before it airs. I want to watch it now. Then do it? Who's stopping you? Wait a minute, can I just like... Ah. Mm. I can do something else now? There's nothing left. I should probably just do this normally. I don't know why I'm trying to do fancy things. Oh. They made it worse than it could possibly ever have been in my mind. Okay. <laughs> Is the mod launcher left? No. No, no. <laughs> I'm gonna go feral. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go Ultra Feral and Ultra Moon, my favorite Pokemon games. That's a lie. I don't like Ultra Sun, nor do I like Ultra Moon. I don't think I actually played them. Sun and Moon were awful. I, I'm sorry, any Sun and Moon apologists get out. Terrible, terrible games. Like, literally not good in any way, shape, or form. Like, Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon might have been fine, I, I didn't play them, but Sun and Moon were actually just dog water. Uh... And this is coming from someone who first played Sapphire and knows that Sapphire is bad as hell. I think Ultra Sapphire, or not Ultra Sapphire, um... Never watched or played Pokemon? That's fine. That's... <laughs> don't... Don't feel ashamed. It is a very daunting thing to play, and it's not really for everyone. It's also... Pokemon is not very good. Like, look, this is from someone who likes Pokemon and consumes a lot of Pokemon. It's not that good. It's it's fine. Like, it's fun. It's cute. Like, there's little Pokemans that you can catch and put in orbs and befriend and draw really confusing art about. But, like, it's just, it's just video game. Like, don't let people obsess over it and be like, Oh, it's the best thing ever, you need to like Pokemon, or you're not a true human being. No, it's it's just a fucking... It's, it's a massive franchise. Just don't worry about it. Digimon, on the other hand, is based... <laughs> Digimon is, is a nightmare, holy shit. I wish there was, like, a one good Digimon video game. There probably is. I, I played like, a few, and they're really bad. There's been some new ones out. I kind of want to play one of the new Digimon games. 
Because I like Digimon, like, the design-wise. I think a lot of them are really fun. But good lord, Digimon is, like... In terms of video games, there's, like, no good fucking video games. Holy moly. This game has good music I play. It's a very interesting philosophy to have with the world. I would like to uh, bring your attention to... I'm gonna die over here. I'd like to bring your attention to a little-known game such uh, called Dragon Quest VIII Journey of the Cursed King. Dragon Quest VIII is probably one of my favorite games of all time. Is it good? Uh, you know, it's alright, I guess. It's definitely a JRPG with all warts and all. Dragon Quest in general is like the potato chips of uh, JRPGs in that it is like very soothing, but um, kind of nothing. Very cute design, very good art. Just absolutely gorgeous music. Look up the Dragon Quest VIII symphonic or symphonic? Uh, the orchestral. Dragon Quest VIII soundtrack. Medieval RPG games aren't your thing? Then just look up the soundtrack. Dragon Quest VIII OST is really good. If it sounds like it's made by a, a, an orchestra then that's the correct one. There's one of them that's like more bit crushy and that's like the one that the Japanese version got because it came out like way before the other one. Also... Like, can we can we stop with the dust? I hate this. Who thought this was fun? This isn't fun. I don't like this level. Stop it! I I hate it. I hate it. Do not like. Just remove that spike. Get rid of it. I know there's cycles and stuff, but it's it's not... They're, like, weird, and, like, they don't... Uh, I don't want to time shit. I don't care. Don't give me things to time. I get it. It's a platform where I have to use, like, complex mathematics in my freaking brain. But I just don't like them. Ugh. Left, right, left, right, left, right, left. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter if I know the thing, because I'm not going to be able to fucking do it. Like, it doesn't matter if there's now a metronome in my brain that tells me when these things work. I don't understand the perfect timing of each thing. I, I use my dash, so there's no point. I don't understand the, like, thingy. Like, I can't time myself, because I don't know the arc of the jump. I don't know how... God, that one right there can eat a clam chowder with extra salt. It's like the timing, sure, I'm sure the timing would help someone who understands, like, patterns and shit, but my brain doesn't work <laughs> at all. So I'm going to sit here and, like, chaos theory it, because I don't care. I don't want to think and learn how my fucking... <laughs> I just, I just don't, I don't care. The, the, they have weird, funny. The, the stamina is like actually fucking me here. This is the first time that stamina has been this much of a problem throughout the entire game, and I played through fucking half a farewell. There, I did it. I did it again. Ow. Yowza. I'm doing it. I'm gonna do it. No one can stop me. Dip. Dop. Dip. Dop. Dip. Fuck you. <laughs> I don't know how I'm doing this without, like, getting the jump back some of the time. Oh, there's more. Do a reverse wave dash? Okay. Hold on. Uh, 
I don't know. What do you mean reverse? Like, like this? What is a reverse wave dash? Fuck you. Okay, hold on. How am I supposed to do that one up there? <laughs> okay, alright. Fine, video game. I'll do this as sluggishly as possible. I couldn't grab. Jump on the blob on the top, go right. You tricked me! Oh, the blob on the top goes right. Oh. Why did I do that? So, okay, occasionally when I do that thing, I get my jump back. Is it, like, do I have to wait a, a smidgen longer than I'm waiting? I think it is. I think it's totally it. Yeah, no, that's totally it. There's like a, there's like a frame. Oh, I'm up here now. That's fine. We'll just live up here. That's not gonna happen. I assume my controller is gonna die. That's. I'm guessing you don't mean there. Why'd I do that? Blah. Why did I do that again? It, uh, that has to be up top. Wait, no, hold on. I don't remember how to do this now. No, oh, like that apparently. Okay, everything's fine. It's fine. I I don't know why I try to make that more complicated than it was. Uh I'm just I'm honestly just trying to get a view of the entire level now. What is past there? I'm I'm feel like I'm going to get tricked. Oh, that's ugly. I don't like that. Oh. Oh, I see what the problem is here. Cute. By cute, I mean I'm gonna throw up in my own mouth. Well, by doing a hyper dash while in the air, you'll most likely get your dash back. Oh, like that? Oh, like that. I see. Oops. Lean. Oh. Okay. I'm gonna lean into my nostrils in a second here. That doesn't mean anything. That is not a sentence. Uh. What, what is the point of these little gumball guys? Like, what, what is their d duty? Why do they exist? Can I, like, tell them to go away? Can I pay them, like, a billion dollars to actually fuck off? Can I give them a strawberry? There's plenty of those lying around on this damn mountain. I, 
I thought I jumped. I don't know why I didn't. <sighs> They're a manifestation of his anxiety? Oh. I see. Give them ice cream problem solved. <laughs> but what if they don't like me? That's why they gave me ice cream. <laughs> Summons more dust bunnies. I didn't get my jump back. Okay. thought that was going to be a an exit. I don't think there's a way to cleanly just jump this. I bet I have to dash, don't I? Oh, or I could just cheat, I guess. There's like no way to do that, is there? Demo, demo dashes? Oh, like Demo Knight TF2. Okay, that's not possible. <sighs> what? Huh? I don't know what I did there. Oh, there's gunk here. Why is there gunk here? Can there just not be gunk here? Can can there just like not be like this? Is this necessary for this gunk to be here? Like, I'm gonna die. This gunk on the floor is not needed. <sighs> Why did I even do that? I knew that wouldn't work. Why did I do that? 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 Why? Why? My only consolation is that the dust bunnies look like they're in incredible pain with, like, when I collide with them. Like, they look like they're actually dying whenever I dash into them. I really hope moments after I dash into them, they just, like, experience a billion years of agony before succumbing to the cold, dark grave. I know I have to wait, I know I have to wait, I know I have to wait, I know I have to wait. Going to get late night water? Oh, hold on. Mm. All right, water consumed. Oh, I have tea too. Mm. Mm. Tea consumed. I don't know why I did that. Ah, ah, ah. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. Do you see it? See the the word it? I hate it. Wah. Wah. the doctor. I'm dying. The doctor kills me with a gun. There. Now you're no longer dying. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it so much. Okay, that one, that was the first time that thing's killed me. <sighs> okay. 
I, I'm not. I'm really not thrilled about how the fact that I see that shit to the right. Oh my god! Fan fantastic. My stamina ran out. Golly! My hands sure do be tired in this washing machine room. Room constructed entire out of ventilation and washing machines. You are a flowing ocean filled with pollution and plastic. Okay, that's fine, I guess. I guess. We didn't need it. We didn't need it. We can look at this room for a little bit. Okay. Dang it. I meant to just hold on to the, the little tip. Oh. One of these days I'll play a level that has, like, ground for me to stand on and I'll truly be happy. I'll be like, oh my god, a, a thing for me to stand on that isn't a fucking kill surface? What a novel concept. <sighs> Fuck you. <laughs> Thanks. I want to look at the stage now. This doesn't seem too bad at all. What is this garbage? What am I looking at? What is this, like, filth that I'm witnessing? Oh, I see. It's one of the... Can we stop with the stamina system? Yeah, I get it. You programmed a stamina system. Stop making levels that are only there to test the stamina system. I get it. We're all very proud of you. You made a stamina system. Stop it. Oh, fuck off. Uh, I'm actually angry. That one, that one pissed me off. I was half expecting that one to fall down too. Well, probably gonna need that actually. I whoa. Oopsie. No. Uh oh. Uh. Darn it. Dang it. Gosh, concern it. Uh. I just really wanted to step on those spikes, apparently. Weep and cry and oh, go down here. Apparently, not at all, boy. <laughs> ha, 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 ha. <laughs> Dang it! <laughs> I need to quiet down. My roommates are probably really tired of hearing my noises, <laughs> but it's fine. I'm moving out this week. They'll never hear my noises ever again, ever again, <laughs> never ever. They won't hear a single peep out of me. Hey, ever again. <laughs> uh, how it feels to chew five gum. Just show the homepage of the Ultra Kill butt plug mod. Uh,
Well, that's a shame. Okay, cool. Uh, that one's rough. Oh, whoa. Why would they be tired of the noises? The screams of agony are always the best part of Celeste streams. Eh, you know. More of them works in a library. That's why. <laughs> That's a little me. Oh. See. Ah, Goo Lagoon, a wonderful place of sand and sea. Time to watch my favorite creature, SpongeBob SquarePants. Hi. One, two, three, four. Everyone's eating off the floor. We have plates in the kitchen. I don't know why they're eating off the floor. Someone grab the floor kitchen plates, give them to me so I can wash them, mate. <laughs> Uh, okay, here we go. I will use my favorite rhyme to get through this sticky situation. Beaver, one beaver, all, let's all do the beaver crawl. Beaver, two beaver, three, let's all climb the beaver tree. Beaver, four beaver, five, let's all do the beaver jive. Beaver six, beaver seven, I'm being sent to beaver heaven. <laughs> One, two, three, four, I'm knocking on your... You know what? What if I just sing? If I just sing, I feel like my mind will be in a more succinct locale. And I can do this, and I'll be like, holy moly, she's gaming. Everyone, look, that girl's gaming. She's gaming. Yeah. All right, fine. I'll just, I'll just normal. I won't, I won't weird. <laughs> huh? Huh? Wait a minute. Wait a on. Hold the fucking phone. Check this shit out. <laughs> no, hold on. I have an idea. I actually have an idea. Damn it. Oh, God, the floor is too kill happy. I can't do my idea. I was thinking that if I save my dash, I could like dash underneath the bottom thing there. That would not go very well. I can't imagine. I re I'm just gonna like tape. No, I'm not. I was gonna say, I'm just gonna like tape the right trigger down so that I'm always climbing because I can't think of a moment in which I would not want to climb. Dang it. I, 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 I'm your little butterfly. Nice. Uh, what the fuck? What is wrong with you? Why would you do this? Why would you do this? Why would you do this? Down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up. Why did I do that? I don't like this. I don't like this room. This room this room can like can slurp a hoagie. Like a like a really greasy, not that good, like uncooked hoagie. didn't need to have things around it. I'm guessing all of those, um, all of those bounce pads collapse. Because, like, why would they be there otherwise if not to disappoint me? Huh. 
<sighs> Why'd I do that? Wait, oh, there's a thing here. Nice. Yep, they do. They're only here to disappoint me. Easiest peasy of my fucking life. Uh, yeah, okay, that's what I thought. What the fuck, Mr. Oshiro? I thought we were done doing this, mister. really annoying. Okay, well, I can probably just, like... I can't just... Hmm. Oh, I can I can crouch dash. Cool, 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 cool. I thought I could, but I can't. Ugh. Fuck you. That... They really just put all this garbage right here. Eat scum. <laughs> what? <laughs> Did B just... Oh, God. That's not good. People are recognizing my B voice. That's kind of a problem. <laughs> People shouldn't recognize my B voice. <laughs> <laughs> Oh no. <laughs> Whoa, it's lit in here, huh? <laughs> Stop existing! Quit munching and crunch. Go away. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Don't. Uh, B is a. Uh, is this a thing? No, it's not. Okay. Oh, I see. That's a problem. B is a D&D &D character that I I play uh, semi-frequently. No, I'll explain it. I mean, what the fuck else am I going to talk about in this level? Um, they're a goblin, and I have, like... They're, like, the one character that I've managed to voice act pretty, free, like, consistently. Um, I don't know if I can do their voice without, like, being prompted. The problem is, every single time that I'm in a D&D &D session and I'm playing as a character that I have a voice for, I literally need someone to ask me a question... Like, ask that character a question for me to, like, get into character and say it. So, someone has to ask B a question. And it's... And that sounds like I'm crazy when I say that. Are you... Are you, like, ripping my toenails off right now? I feel like you are, Celeste, for the N64. No, oh, that's a shame. <laughs> I don't want it. Uh, my opinion's on the level. Ugh, I'd rather play literally anything else than this level right now. Ah, I hate this level. I hate it. I hate it. I hate these dust clouds. I hate Mr. Ashiro. I don't want to be here. Ah, I don't want to be here. I don't want to be playing this level. I don't... I, I'm so tired of dash sliding. Please. <laughs> I hate this. Oh, I didn't want to do this boss fight again. Oh. Hold on. I I'm skipping this part. Oh, or not, I guess. Fuck me. Hold on. Alright. Fuck you. Oh my god. Suck a fucking, like, eggplant. There. Oh, excuse me? Uh But no, B kind of has a has a nasally voice. It's it's hard to explain. 
I, I, it's hard to do her voice now, actually, um, because I played her a lot. Uh, I played her a lot, um, like two arcs ago. When did I last play her? Was it just last arc? It might have just been last arc. And I, I played her for a very long arc. And I also played her for like one of my one of the times that I DM'd, but. It's been a while. I'm playing a different character now whose voice is much more... Hello, this is the character that I currently play. They have a lot of vocal fry. Like, they kind of have... Uh, how, do I, how do I do their voice? Hey, hey, hey. I can't do it. I, I, my throat is not feeling fantastic tonight. Do we really have to have a, another round of this boss fight? Because I kind of hated this boss fight. It wasn't awful, but it certainly wasn't fun. We didn't need a round two. <sighs> oh, of course. How foolish of me. Oh my god, okay. Oh. Oh, I see. Oh god. Why? Like, actually, why? Who would do this? Like, are you are you joking? What the fuck is wrong with you, developer? Like never again. <laughs> There's something actually wrong with you. If you <laughs> Holy shit. Oh my fucking god. <laughs> this is awful. Okay, cool. Oh. Sorry, I need to like sit here for a second. But no, B's fun. Um, she, I guess I can explain the character. I don't know, Koshak, are you fat? Are you interested in all at tabletop RPG stories and characters or is that something that you are not interested in at all. Because it definitely gives, like, me having something to talk about during this game weirdly makes me perform a lot better. Okay. I'm gonna vomit. <laughs> Oh, oops. Sure, if I want. I mean, if, it's only if you're interested. I'm not going to start rambling to, to an audience that dislikes stuff like that. Because I, I have definitely been on, on streams before where it's like, okay, we get it, you play D&D, kind of thing. But I always like talking about my dumb little characters and stuff like that. But I feel like people probably get enough of that during the art streams. On. Off. On, off, on, off. I'm gonna fucking kill. <laughs> okay, all right, all right, all right. Um. So, I've been playing in a pretty consistently meeting uh, tabletop game pretty much every Sunday. That's actually awful, what they did there. Like, unnecessarily awful. Pretty consistently meeting D&D game every Sunday? Um, oh, I did it. 
Well, that's going to be a problem later. We'll deal with it later. Or right now. And, uh, God, how long has it been going on for, like, four years at this point, I think? Um, I think it's about four years, yeah. That seems about right. Okay. And, um... B was a character that I introduced, like, maybe a couple of years ago for a one-shot in the setting. Um, we were going to do something that was like a little bit of a break from what we were currently doing. Oh my god, that is a lot of deaths. 507, golly. Yeah, you know, I'll take a short break and talk about <laughs> tabletop RPG characters. Let me get my, let me get some water. And I'll, I'll ramble for like 10 minutes. I'll ramble and eat a gummy vitamin, because I probably should eat a gummy vitamin. I haven't been eating good food today. By the way, when I say gummy vitamin, Oh, let's not do that on stream. I'll, I'll, I will do that though. That does sound fun. You know, I, I, fuck it. I'll do it right now. Just send it to me on Discord, and I'll set it up. Wait, no. Unless it's like it. Okay. Do I have to make an account for it? Because if I do, I'm not doing that on stream. I see. No. No account. Ah. Uh... Send it to me and I'll set it up after the stream. But I won't do it right now. Because I'm just going to sit here for a smidge. Anyway. Um, so B was introduced probably two years ago or maybe a year ago for a one-shot thing. We were kind of in between two major arcs of the story. And one of my friends joined the campaign kind of later. And they were, and the way that the game works is that like once you're done DMing an arc, you swap off to the next person, and then they do an arc, which is pretty great to avoid burnout. It does have its own problems, but I'd recommend at least trying it, because it's fun to see everyone's style and stuff like that. So we, I can't remember what we just finished, but. We had a minor thing start that I believe my friend described as it's going to literally be Monster Hunter, where there's a giant monster that you have to track down and learn its weakness and hunt it. And it's going to be like one giant boss fight. And I was like, well, I, I wanted to try a new character for a little while. I wanted to try mixing Ranger and Rogue. Mind you, this is we're playing 5th edition, which I have my qualms with the system, but it's just what we were playing at the time. And I made B. B had like no backstory, aside from how she kind of got to the higher level that we started at. And she was specialized in like being very sneaky and being very good right at the start of combat like she had really really high burst damage the first round but after that she was kind of not great and she had a gun because i wanted to try out firearms i wanted to try out all these things anyway so she showed up for this monster hunter thing and it was kind of implied like her backstory implied that one of the other characters in the guild hall hired her a few times for like information for other things to kind of tie her into the group that we were playing in. And she did the Monster Hunter thing. And that was supposed to be it. She was just kind of supposed to be there for that. And nothing else, really? But she showed up another time. I think it was either the Monster Hunter one or it was the one right before that that she showed up for. And I just had fun with her and I was like, fuck it. I'll play her again. And I just played her twice and then I kind of forgot about her. Um, later I DM'd something... 
that had like a big time skip due to something weird and cataclysmic that happened and everyone was kind of in like a bad future version of the world that we were inhabiting and one and i was like tallying up all the people that would have lived and would have not lived mind you i'm not like i didn't like permanently kill a bunch of characters obviously this was just supposed to be like a fun time travel thing in like a wildly different setting so uh, B ended up being one of the characters that would have lived because they didn't technically live at the guild hall at the time. And I had her show up in that arc as kind of like a, a DM NPC to act as a contact near the start because they didn't really know anyone in the area. So she didn't really do a lot in terms of like combat, obviously, because if, if I ever make a DM NPC that's going to help the party, they're going to be there for ancillary ushering the plot in a direction or giving the players hint not hints but like um how do i explain it like if they need someone to do something that can kind of just be handled off screen it's good to have characters like that like oh can you help us get this is like i'll see what i can do but it'll cost like this and this it's always good to have a contact to hand wave some things like that um anyway weirdly enough halfway through that arc in the bad future one of the other characters uh, just randomly hit on B. And I was like, I never expected a single person to interact with this character aside from, like, plot shit. So I was, like, put on the spot and I had to come up with, like, personality for that angle of the character. Just instantly. And I was like, okay, how would this character, who is kind of antisocial, react to being hit on randomly? And as it turns out, it was, uh, they'd be very embarrassed. Anyway, one thing led to another, and that character, uh, B just ended up being, like, one of the most char uh, played characters that I've ever had. I, like, played them for, like, three games in a row or something, and they just, they just, it just clicked. I don't know. So, she just ended up being a lot of fun to play. Like, her build was fun. It didn't feel annoying or complicated despite having like despite being a ranger like a rangers in 5e are so terrible but like just something about that character was a lot of fun and um coincidentally i ended up having to do her voice a lot because i played her a fuck ton all that being said um man every once in a while i just do that fucking voice because i'm used to doing it okay so yeah, that's that's B. B is just a weird goblin that I sometimes speak the voice in. I'm sorry, I'm sure that was like a really confusing explanation. Because I, I really don't know how to explain B. B's a goblin. Okay, how would I... I think I'd have to go bottom down right on that one. Ugh. Okay, this isn't too bad so far. Ah. Oh. Ah. Oh. If you want to ask questions about B, that, I mean, like, like I said, I'm really bad at coming up with things on the spot unless I'm prompted. But any questions about anything, I'll answer more about the setting or shit like that. It's, it's been really fun so far. Um, establishing a lot of the lore for that setting because everyone kind of has been collaborating on it for a very long time and it's I don't know it, it's one of those things where like all of us are very done with the system but we love the world so we're planning on transferring the world to Pathfinder 2 because we want to try that out but I kind of realized over the course of like that whole long ass campaign that a lot of the stuff that could have happened that I really enjoyed, or a lot of stuff that did happen that I really enjoyed, could have happened in any fucking system. Well, any fantasy system, I should say. How's the game going right now? Like, where's the world at? Currently, um, we're playing a, a lot of, we're, we're not playing a lot of characters who've been around for a long time, because a lot of us are trying out new things. It's kind of a last, uh, not a last hurrah, but like, just, uh, it'd be fun if we tried out these more wacky builds. We are currently in a city a little ways to the west of our original stomping grounds called Suter. 
that was known as like a very warlike kind of barbarian city and it had like a lot of political issues and recently there was a a like a merchant's rebellion that overthrew the um the major oh interesting i think i can do this hold on there was a merchant's rebellion that overthrew like the the tyrant king or whatever but after that happened we were like okay sure whatever but after that happened a bunch of weird shit started happening like a lot of trade routes got interrupted by what seemed to be weird dragon attacks or some shit and um uh, a lot of people are just fucking dying randomly I thought that was a thing I could break okay hold on oh I see what I have to do there and we have a a, a small motley crew of weirdos that ha that went out to investigate what's going on and as it turns out there is a uh what do I how do I even explain it there's like shadow fey because there's like the fey wild and then the it doesn't it's not important there's like weird like fey that are trying to reclaim the city in the name of their queen because apparently like she owns the city despite you know not having been here in like 2000 years or some whack shit like that and we just learned how to like try to get into her court to reason with her or something and i am currently playing as uh, ironically another goblin named ite who's like a bare knuckle brawler type and um it's 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 going strangely we just figured out how to get an audience with this queen that is trying to retake this strange fucking city. I'm still concerned about the dragon that is apparently around. I don't know what to do about that because it's... Uh, I can only punch things and this thing can apparently fly and like melt entire fortresses down in like an instant because we keep on finding these ruined, destroyed structures. Um, as far as the rest of the world, the guild that we're a part of actually just established a brand new base of operations in a like gnomish city that is kind of inspired by like Greek culture called Carambola. Uh, wait, where the fuck am I supposed to go here? Huh? Oh, shit. I think I know what I have to do. This has to go like the whole way. That's kind of miserable. I see. Okay. Oh, fuck off actually fick off so we we went and like we established a new guild hall um and we're gonna use like the old one that we lived in for fucking years and years as like another branch basically but all of the elder elder members a lot of the i guess elder members i don't really know what to call them a lot of the old uh guild hall members are gonna stay at the new place because it's a lot nicer <laughs> But, I don't know, it's just, it's one of those things, it's fun. I, wow, I actually kind of hate this. I, we've already done this. Just throwing that out there, like, we, we I've done this before, I've played race with a, with one of these fucking blocks before. I didn't want to do it again, that was like, one of my least favorite parts of whatever fucking level that was. Right now, in terms of, like, political climate, the big thing is this suitor situation. We're trying to figure out what happened, why the king was actually killed, aside from, like, the very obvious reasons of, like, a merchant's re rebellion. Because there's clearly a lot of foul play. The king wasn't exactly well-liked, or the barbarian, I don't know what they were, they were fucking called, the emperor or whatever. They were, they were clearly not well-liked, but... This is a little unprecedented. So there's clearly like whack shit going on and it's concerning because a lot of the people who are around that city are worried that even more horrible shit is going to happen. There's apparently another adventuring group that's been playing cleanup on all of our jobs that was just... They weren't... I guess they were technically just introduced, but it, it's implied that they have been around for a very long time and they got their name from 
uh, every single time that we had a job, they did everything that we didn't finish doing, apparently. Which is like, it was supposed to be intentionally kind of infuriating that they basically got their all their fame from our sloppy seconds and implying that we were really shit at our job, which is kind of true. We're not very good at our job. <laughs> We've done uh, a lot of jobs that ended with like a, what about that one thing? Well, we don't know. <laughs> oh, well, I guess, <laughs> I guess that's fine. The day is saved, but there's still all this financial insecurity and, and all this stuff. It's like, oh, don't worry about it. The day's saved. Who's DMing next? <laughs> It's like, uh, okay. But it's fun. It's, it's a very fun plot point. Um, I'm trying to think. Oh my god. Oh, that, that was really jank. <sighs> this kind of sounds like In Love with a Ghost. This music. Oh, it is In Love with a Ghost? No fucking way. I didn't look at it. Oh, fuck. Hold on. Oh, I wish I could see the... The... Because it showed the remix at the start, and I was not paying attention at all, and I feel bad. Perfect. Ah! Just get rid of that. Just, just get rid of it. Get rid of that thing. Get rid of that little spike sticking out to the left. This game doesn't need to be perfectly difficult. Just make it, like... Just difficult, but like kind of a little forgiving. It doesn't need that that extra frustration point to specifically irritate me. This is why I was never a fan of fucking Super Mario Maker either, because people would just replay levels over and over and remove every possible pixel. Team to screenshot, hold on. No shit. I actually can't fucking believe that it's in love with a ghost. I'm more surprised that I immediately recognized that it was in love with a ghost. They do have quite the recognizable style, all things considered. With the wailings and whatnot. I need to go back and listen to more in love with a ghost. That was one of my favorite bands for a very long time. I bet they put out a ton of new music since I stopped listening, which was a very long time ago. But yeah, no, I, I probably, I probably talk a lot about um, my dang D and D game. I probably talk a lot about the different characters that are in there. I'm sure I've talked about like J and shit before, and Blue and J. I mean, I definitely draw them a lot. They reference a ton in the drawing streams. Because it's just, I don't know. I, I get it. Like, it's one of those things where for years on Tumblr would be like, oh, this is my original character, Grimble Dimbus. And I'm like, oh, huh. It's interesting that people have characters. I've never thought about it like that. And then ever, <laughs> as soon as I got some, I was like, oh, I get it. I see why people go absolutely feral for characters that they invent. Because they want to see them in more things. Because they made something that they're proud of. So I'm, I'm, I apologize if it gets annoying whenever I talk about my goobers. But hell, it, it's just, it's a thing. Everyone has their weird obsessions. Mine just happen to be very stereotypical, I guess. Characters that I've made up. Uh, storm clouds, plants, uh, fucking tarot cards tattoos, shit like that, I don't know. It used to be Magic the Gathering, not so much anymore. Indifferent at the very worst, at the very, at least usually kind of interesting. That's fair. 
I promise not to, like, always fucking talk about them. Because there's only so much to talk about, all things considered. And it's gonna be one of those things where, like, um... There will be a place to read about them, eventually. Because, like, I'm planning on making little webcomics about one or two of them, just so that I can practice stuff. Because there is a really big webcomic that I want to make, eventually. Um... But... Fuck. But, um... In order to, like, learn paneling and structure and pacing and all those things that, like, are kind of important to understand when making webcomics, I'm gonna practice it on some stuff with some of the characters from Roundtable, which is the the D&D &D thing. Because, uh, I don't know. I know the characters. I know how I want them to act and stuff like that. And it'll, it'll be a good place to practice. Oh, that's... I see. Oh, golly. Okay. Can I just make this jump? Hold on. Okay. Okay. I, uh... I certainly see. I, I certainly do. Hmm. Oh, I get it. I get it. No, I get it. I get it now. I don't get it. Is it just a thing you do for fun with friends, or is it a podcast? Oh, it is absolutely just a thing I do for fun with friends. It is not a podcast at all. I would never subject. To, I would never subject them to like becoming content or anything like that. Um. Oh, oh, oh no. Yeah, it's it's literally just a um a game on Saturday or on Sundays that I play. It's not um it's not a podcast. Although that could be fun. I doing a tabletop RPG podcast has definitely been intriguing and I've kind of done stuff like that similar before but that's one of those things where everyone going into it has to be like okay this is going to be content like this is going to be a show you have to realize that and there are some things that you just kind of have to hand wave it's it's hard to explain oh well let's see if I can just cheese this a little bit no, there's no way. Oh, hmm. Why is that bubble there? I feel like this is supposed to be a thing that isn't regular progression. Nope. Not at all. Okay. Oh, I'm just supposed to dash to the right. I get it. I get it. I get it. Like so. <laughs> um, yeah, I, I really wanted to do some kind of RPG podcast. I feel like if I did, it would be Lancer, maybe? Because Lancer just seems like faster I, it would never be 5e I'm, I I've never want to think of 5e ever again after I'm done with round table 1 because goddamn, dude 5e is really just it has driven me crazy it definitely has its ups and downs like 5e is not a perfectly shit system don't get me wrong I just God, it's... Ugh, I'm just so done with it. I've played it for too long. It was the only thing in the world that anyone ever played for years and years and years, and I get it. Like, it's it's pretty easy to hop into. It's just kind of suffering to play as the DM. And, oh, and knowing that it's not that fun for the DM is, like, really, like, kind of not heartbreaking. It's hard to explain. It's just, it just feels bad. Alright, hold on. 
I got this. I understand. Yeah, I don't understand. I don't know what I'm doing. There we go. Oh, excuse me? Hello? I think I'm just... I, hmm. I think it's fine personally. I'm excited to move to Pathfinder 2e. Yeah, I think I'm just excited for change. Because I'm sure Pathfinder will have its own set of, like, awful things that we have to deal with. But, like, God, it's just... I'm so done with Pathfinder... Or I'm so done with 5e. Okay. What do I do? What do I do there? Uh, backseating, backseating on. Everyone tell me what the fuck to do. Go to the left side, then to the right again. Hold on. I, I have to beat that. I have to beat that initially. We had like a few rooms of bliss and now we're just back to hell. Go to the right and then you can go to the left side, then to the right again. I guess I can't use my jump. I, I don't know why I, I can't wrap my head around this. Oh, like so. Fuck off! <laughs> Ugh, the stamina system is so bad! Just get rid of it, I understand why it's a thing, but it sucks complete fucking eggs. I understand that you don't want people to cling on to shit for literally ever, but... God damn, it makes some of these levels infuriating as fucking hell. Specifically, uh, these last, like, three ones. Because it adds, like, a jump limit, limit, basically. It's like you can't jump more than fucking three times. Have fun, kids. So I have to be pixel perfect, and I have to use a... Oh, don't worry, all right, well, that, that's not going to happen. You can just jump off walls without grabbing to save stamina, but I have to grab on some of these. <sighs> oh, yeah. Ah, uh, I see. Okay. So I have to jump over this fucking thing like three times. That... Okay. Okay, it's dead. I was gonna try to... I was really gonna try to make it back down here. Probably wasn't gonna be possible, but... I mean, I'm sure. I'm sure a lot of rooms are like that. Once you understand the funny mechanic, it's like, oh, this is no problem at all, but... Ugh. Okay, we're fine. There's no other jeep here. Hello! Okay. We got another moving thing. We got another one of these... Switch rooms. Okay, I think I get this. Did 
Do you think Celeste would be a good voice chat game, like having co-host? Uh, probably, God. Just because I, half the time I'm just sitting here going, <laughs> So potentially. I don't think it would be, I don't think it'd be downgraded by that at all. I mean, hell, like, what was the game that I played recently that was, like, vastly improved by having another person on? Pathfinder 2, holy shit, Pathfinder 2, uh, sorry, not Pathfinder 2. Pathfinder Wrath of the Righteous. It, it, it's Pathfinder 2. Not as in the system, but as in the video game, Pathfinder 2. As in Peggle 2. Uh, oh, right, there's a thing I can grab on there. There's a lot of games that are like that. I mean, just me in general. I I have a pretty rough time uh, streaming a lot of games by myself. I mean, I'm sure a lot of people do. Because I can't fill all the dead air. RimWorld is... Holy shit, RimWorld is a fucking miserable game to not have a person on the stream with. Like, uh, I... People love watching my RimWorld streams. More power to them, because I could not watch my own RimWorld streams. I tried editing some of my RimWorld streams together at some point. Holy fucking shit. Why do people watch me play that game? Because it's just me saying okay for, like, probably four hours. I'm, guess I'm guessing people just like to watch me, like, fuck up and die a lot. Um. Okay, hold on. Where do I go there? Probably up to the right. I mean, if you're fine listening to my goblin noises, I'm pretty sure a Celeste co host would be a lot of fun. Or being a co host on a Celeste stream would be a lot of fun. Maybe up and then just. Oopsie. Yeah, it's probably just straight up. Yeah, it is. That one is a little more rough. Ah, I ran out of stamina. Could never enjoy a game like RimWorld. I get that the whole point is everything is against you, but I can't deal with that. I... Oh, I, I kind of, I want to be perfectly honest, I kind of hate that that's part, part of the systems of RimWorld, is that everything is against you. But, man, it's a, it's a hell of a thing. I, I, I like, I like RimWorld because I like building a base and experimenting with systems and planning out different designs for, like, architecture and like making my little village nice and like watching people get married and it's literally the sims for people who find the sims a little mechanically simple <laughs> like i'll be perfectly honest uh the rim world is just the sims rim world is just the sims with violence I, i'm not even like gonna sugarcoat it they are very similar games Rimworld just doesn't... Oh god, Rimworld has a lot of DLC now. Rimworld is just The Sims. Rimworld is just The Sims. Hmm, I think I have to go straight up on that one. There's a Minecraft mod called Mine Colonies that has that, but isn't awful, I think. I get that you really don't know me that well, but I'd be down to co-host if you wanted. Uh, maybe. I think that'd be interesting. Maybe if once I do, like, um... I know that you're into, like, the modding scene of this game quite a bit. So maybe if I do some of those, that'd be a lot of fun. I kind of want to do the base game just me, though. But I, if I do the, the like, strawberry jam or whatever, like, all those crazy things, I think that'd be really fun to have a co-host on that. Oh, goodness, sorry. I am... I'm fading fast here. 
Let me make sure that my roommates haven't texted me and told me to shut the fuck up. Nope. Because it's not that late yet. Um. Ow. Owie. Ah, that one's rough. Actually, I could probably do the bottom one here. Or not. No, let's not do that. Honestly, I couldn't sit through the stuff like Feral and the Heart of B-Sides and the fucking C-Sides, dear god, the C-Sides by myself, just because it's vanilla doesn't mean it doesn't- There are C-Sides? What the fuck is a C-Side? And don't make an ocean joke. Don't worry about the C-Side yet. Okay. Kaizo Mario? Yeah, I'd rather do my taxes, and I didn't make enough to, to pay taxes. That's where you get seashells. Oh, holy shit. Mm, I love cubes, I love cubes, I love cubes, I love watching them move, I love putting them in my mouth, I love chewing on them. Cubes, 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 cubes. Nothing quite like cubes, man. Let me just go to the cube store and buy myself some cubes. I love cubes. Give me cubes. Man, look at all these cubes go. Top 10 cube moments. Number one, fucking Celeste cubes. Uh huh. Uh huh. No, 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 do not give me 200 If someone gives me fucking $200,000, I'll probably just quit streaming. If you really want to stop me, if you hate me that much that you don't want me to stream, give me $200,000 right fucking now. This room sucks on a first playthrough, I'm warning you. Uh, sorry. I'm fucking too cool. Look how cool I fucking am. Bam, cool. <laughs> Not 200,000, just 20,000. If you hate me that much, give me 20,000. <laughs> ah. I see. What would you do if you had one of those cues in real life? Oh. I, I can't say it on stream. I would probably ride it slightly to the right and then it would explode, killing me instantly. <laughs> what answer do you want? Oh, I'll stick it in myself. Just a regular old cubophile. I need, I need to be quiet. I feel bad now. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> How about I write you slightly to the right and kill you instantly? Damn, okay, hot. I mean, uh, bad, don't do that. Don't fuck the cube. Oh, cube. I love you, cube. Ethereal matter? <laughs> I need to make that comic. Hold on. <laughs> Hold on, this is very important.
I'm writing something down. <laughs> I'm putting this in my not safe for work drawing ideas. Okay. All right. Bad drawing idea has been implanted. Cool. Excuse me? Uh, no, it's fine. No. <laughs> I don't mean to complain, but um, I'm just holding down the grab button on that one. Ah! <laughs> Largest red flag when it comes to becoming an odd safer work artist I've noticed is you're struggling with a video game mechanic and go, yeah, I want that thing to rail me. I don't want to fuck the Celeste Cube. Throwing that out there. I, 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 you cannot fuck it. It is a cube. Don't bring up the Junji Ito House comic. Don't bring up the Junji Ito House comic. Don't bring up the Junji Ito House comic. I don't care about the Junji Ito House comic. Don't look it up either. Okay. Don't look it up. No, don't think about it. This is a hard one. Oh, I should probably do this. It's exactly what it says on the tin. Some chick fucks a house. I think. <laughs> I don't know. I haven't read it. I just saw someone reference it. Yeah, the horror guy. Thanks, cube. No, oh, I just kind of clambered up on top of that thing. Oh well. This is a very unique kind of frustrating room because this cube right here doesn't need to exist. Like, that that could not exist and this level would be improved by probably about 15%. No, no, like literally, no, just stop. Just stop existing. <laughs> just it just doesn't need to exist like how many times do I have to prove to you Celeste that I know how like basic gameplay mechanics work just stop giving me these these tribulations God gives his funniest battles to his silliest clowns after all but like like I'm not that silly of a clown Somebody used to make a parody of those remodeling house and surprising the family shows where it's some guy where it's a guy hammering some nails. That would hurt a lot, I think. It hurt a lot. Oh Jesus Christ. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> how are you? <laughs> Hi, Vac Rone, how are you? Is it Rone or Ronette? How would you prefer me pronounce that name? Oh, oopsie. Great combo to walk in on. I'm so sorry. Welcome to hell. Uh, huh. Yeah, okay, well, let's just go back down here. 
Welcome to the stream. I hope you enjoy your stay. We are uh, desperately trying to... Why do I always get scared by my own stream notifications? Because I forget that I have them. Huh? Oh, well. Abby of the two... Oh, any of the two will do. Okay. Evac Rone sounds fancy. I might say that. Oops. Oh, well, we, goodbye. I'm going to have like a bazillion and a half deaths by the end of this one. Just throwing that out there. Hello. Oh, there goes a the cube. Uh. Top 10 cube moments. Number one. <laughs> Uh, a bazillion and a half? That's like two football fields! <laughs> it is! How did you know? I'm glad that we're doing some proper American math here in chat today. Ow, my fingers. Not that fancy. In fact, I'd, ask, I'd like to ask you something shameless. Oh my god. Okay, sure. I... I, I will... I will either answer or not answer depending on how, like, truly awful it is. Oh, that's a shame. Sure, though. Fire away. Oh, that's a shame. I'm gonna just... There we go. That's probably faster than <laughs> waiting for the cube to die. Uh, am I interested in having custom graphic designs for my channel? Sadly, while I am, no. I, while I kind of am, the only issue is I have zero dollars, so I am kind of doing that all on my own. Oops. As in, I'm like, I'm drawing a lot of them myself. I, I kind of already have ideas and stuff that I'm doing, so I apologize, but no. Mostly due to I would not be able to, like, financially afford any of it. I do appreciate the offer, though. Whoops, let's not do that. Maybe at some point in the future, perhaps. I've definitely had a few of those offers recently, but I just, I literally just don't have money at all, which is why I'm, I'm, <laughs> it's why I'm doing more and more art streams so that I can actually just afford to do my own graphic design stuff, because it's, uh, oh, that's a shame. Wow, that really reformed quickly. No, that's fair. I appreciate the offer, though. Okay, let's give this one more shot. Oh. I, maybe if I... Hold on. How, how far is this dash? Okay, that dash is sadly not... It's slightly too long to do, like, a fancy... A fancy thing and... Like, dash off the side and grab it. Might recognize that name? Ugh. <laughs> Oops, that's a shame. Ooh, oh, that's a double shame. <sighs> there we go. Let's give this a shot. It's really hard to, like, fall off of the side of a cube and, like, grab it at the same time. Let's do this. Okay. Oh, oh, these clouds are so hard to jump on. Hold on, if I hold down the jump button... No. That's so miserable. I think I just have to practice jumping on these dang things. Uh, all right. Isn't there some company that has people go into chats and ask if they want commissions for their stream? Not the worst thing, doesn't feel malicious or anything. I don't know. I have no idea. I know I had a... I had a bot contact me on Discord recently about a very similar thing. However, they did not feel as sentient, if that makes sense. It, it did not feel like a real person was asking me for work. 
it, it, it genuinely felt like a script. So, or not a script, but like a, not as in a, a script to read, but as in a, a scripted sequence, I should say. Who knows? Yeah, 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 no. I think the person in the chat was a person, but I, I've, I've definitely had robots on Discord ask similar things. It's a very strange market to try to tap. And the other one was about a, a VTuber. They were asking me if I wanted VTuber assets. Oh, yeah. Come on. Oh, I can't believe that happens. Ugh. Yeah, the bots on Discord are a nightmare. I had someone... I was in a stream... Someone gave me a shout out because it was a stream that I kind of frequent and I've rated them a couple times. And someone like literally contacted me on Discord like the minute that I got the shout out. And um it was it was a very scary conversation. And then like later that night someone was like, "Hey, I think there's like a bot in the server because they asked me all these weird questions and they were like, "Oh, yeah, that that is a robot." And I was like, "Oh, thank God." Cuz it just it felt Straight. It didn't feel like I was part of reality anymore. But no. I am, uh, weirdly, I'm immune to stuff like that because I'm fucking poor. <laughs> and I think I'll eternally be that. What were the questions? Well, it started off pretty normal, like asking me if I wanted VTuber stuff done. And I was like, oh, you know, like, in the future, I actually wanted to make a PNG tuber specifically just for art streams because, you know. It'd be kind of fun to have something sitting down there talking and whatever. And then um, they uh, they continued by like saying like uh, like oh you know we're having a sale right now. I was like oh cool can I see some of your work? And then they said oh sale just for you like less like and then they listed like a price and I was like okay cool but like I can't afford anything but I would love to see your work so that in the future if it is something that I'm interested in. And then they just started like begging, please, I will be fired if you do not commission me. It's like, I don't have money. Are you not listening to what I'm saying? I literally don't have money. I can't fucking afford this. <laughs> and then they just kept on sending me like the same message on loop that like, th like the company would fire them if they didn't get this commission. I'm like, that's, that's no. Okay. And I just blocked them. And then uh, later that night, in the Discord, they were like, hey, we had a robot. <laughs> yeah. It's like, I'm sorry. You're gonna get fired either way. You're just gonna waste your time on me. <laughs> oh, it's one of these. It, okay, question. Actually, go fuck yourself. That's so awful. At least it's not, like, the most... It's fine. Everything's fine. Everything is literally fine. Everything is not fine anymore. But yeah, no, it's... It's... <sighs> there's, like, a secret... There's a secret tech to not having any money. It's that, um, you can't... You can't afford to fall for scams if, if they do end up coming your way. Nothing quite like this to get the blood congealing. Wait, hold on. Oh, 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 I hate it. Oh, it's it's way worse than I imagined. Wait a minute. I see. But yeah, I don't know, it's weird. All these games have fallen for were pretty harmless, just the ones where it put you on a rant or a random never ending quiz with ads everywhere. Yeah. Something like that doesn't really exist anymore. Oh, the internet.
Ay, ay. Who's doing all this laundry, by the way? the jump button. Uh, right. I need that. Let's try that again. Let's try that again. More! Wait, 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 Oh, right. I don't like these clouds that are pink. They irritate me. They frustrate me. They make my teeth cause pain. Right. Can't do that. Can't do that either. I'm definitely gonna play some Yu-Gi-Oh! later tonight, after I finish streaming this. I want to I wanna prep for the Yu-Gi-Oh! stream. I need to like actually undo a bunch of the changes that I made to my deck. I kind of added too much stuff to it. Please. I don't know how I nailed this jump the first, like, four times. and then, Oh, it's because... It's because holding down the... I don't know, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Let's just not think about it. Why does this always happen? Why does this always happen to me? ba 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 da 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 Everything you know is wrong. Up is down, left is right, and short is long. Everything you saw is I don't know the lyrics. <laughs> Sorry. Ah, uh, General Kenobi. My fingy hurt. Whoop. Ah. 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 Fellas, if a trans girl invites you over to talk about Bionicle, it is not a code word for sex. She will just talk to you about Bionicle. Heh. <laughs> Fuck. Fuck, okay. I thought I... How did I do that. I got to that bubble once. How did I do that? Alright. Oh, Let me just do a short hop of the clouds. The walking, the waiting strat is kind of jank. Wait, you can do it. Oh! I see. Hi. <sighs> I did not realize. I don't... My brain is like, really like, oh yeah, you gotta jump, you gotta jump immediately, yeah, jump, 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 yeah, dash. Mm. Oh, hey, oh, hey. Oh, hey, it's me, Robin Williams. That's what he sounds like, right? I haven't watched a movie with Robin Williams in it in a very long time, and I know he's dead. Don't fucking say that's because he's not making any more movies. I mean, I just—I guess I just haven't seen a movie in a long time. I kind of want to watch *Goodwill Hunting* again. I haven't seen that one in a long time. Heard that one's good. I mean, it's—it's it's sad. Oh, that's scummy. Okay, so. Okay, like. I think I have to... 
Okay, 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 okay. That's cummy? What the fuck? Did you just say fucking cum in my chat? I will ban you. The cum police will find you. They will find you. <laughs> hey, lewd police. Put your hands up. No, I'm not the police. I ain't doing shit. Do it, ban me. I'm not banning you. You goober. They will come for the sky. I hate this. Top 10 bad sentences. Number one, the worst sentence I've ever said. That one probably. That was a pretty bad sentence. There's just in. Local strawberry girls falls to her death 800,000 times. Why is she doing this? Who knows? Right, I can't do that. You can't uncum the scummy. Scoozy? Ba -da -ba. Gotta say, I'm really in love with the ghost right now. I love bands and or albums that have like really fucking esoteric names. Like In Love with the Ghost is probably my favorite band name. Cause it just it it's sad as shit. Huh. Okay. I'm guessing going this way. Whenever I think in love with a ghost, I just think Napstabluke. Well, yeah, because that's like objectively the best ghost to fall in love with. Aside from... What are other hot ghosts in media? Name hot ghosts in chat. I want to thirst after ghosts. Butthole surfers. God. I have complicated emotions about butthole surfers. I'm sure they're a fine band. I just had a friend who really liked them, and I'm not really friends with that friend anymore. Or I'm, I'm definitely not friends with that friend anymore. Fucking. But. It's a very funny name. Huh. The Lady of the Lake might have been a ghost. That is true. Also might have just been some naked lady with a sword. Which is also kind of hot. This mushroom ghost in Pizza Hour? Not very dateable. I'll have to look up that ghost. I need to play Pizza Tower. A nice relaxing platformer, unlike this one. Oh! Oh, you tricked me. Uh, relaxing. I mean, it's there's no pixel perfect shit. I should say that I get to beat the shit out of the bosses. So we. Huh. Scary. Why hey, is this? Uh, all right. Ah, ah, gulagoon. Oh, I didn't get my jump back. Oh, because I grab, because I grab much like a strawberry, I grab it and put it in my mouth because I eat the berry. Okay. Oh. 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 Banana. Eh. Eto. Sumimasen. Yo necesito un biro y supergetti. Fuck. Something, something, eat my berries. No. 
No? Me gusta mucho esquerra en queso. Uh, Ludon done for the day. Uh, I can't say anything lewd on stream. Ever. Ever, ever. I am a pure chase... The beautiful, pure flower girl. I don't know. I don't know what sentences you want from me. I've never said anything lewd or crude in my entire life. Um, a team of scientists can vouch for me. Right, that is definitely the stream, though, because I am... My finky hurt real bad. Cock! <laughs> Dabs. Hmm. I forgot it's Cloudbeard. Nice. How many deaths? Alright, let's... Oy. Well, how many more B-sides do we have? A lot. A lot, a lot. Oh. No B-side epilogue. What a fucking shame. Is it B-side decor? Oi, oi, oi. Okay. I'm not actually playing Pico 8, I'm just gonna do something real quick. I wanna do this. Okay, that's it. Thanks everyone for tuning in today. Uh, I don't know what I did. I'm not, okay, we're not doing that. There we go. Okay. Ah, so how are all of you doing? This is the end of the stream. I know it's sad. It's sad. You know what? We'll play. We'll play a song. Don't forget the mod thing. I absolutely will. You'll have to remind me. Um, because I, I'm I'm kind of like turning my brain off after the stream. I'll be perfectly honest. I'm gonna go listen to music. I don't have any. Oh, I, I have to take my girl pills soon. Probably. I should actually take them right now. Um. Yeah, I'm installing like a Celeste mod to change my hair color. Or something. I, I, the, the multiplayer thing, too. That could be a fun um, game night, actually. But, uh, that's it for now. Let's get some music going. Hold on. Is it the end of the stream? Ba, 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 ba. You know what? This one. Is it? Oh, okay. This is another game that I actually really want to play on stream. I want to, like, beat Stardew Valley on stream. I know that's like a long game, but it's been so long since I played Stardew Valley. <sighs> Do you want to chill for a bit or should we install it right after stream? Uh... <sighs> I should probably just install it right now because otherwise I will absolutely forget. If it's like a three minute install, it shouldn't be a problem. But I'm absolutely gonna turn my brain off after that. Take take my dang pills and then play Yu-Gi-Oh. But sure. But thank you everyone for hanging out. Thank you to the following folks. Thank you to uh actually that was last stream. Thank you to Evac Rene. I'm not sure if you'll ever be back. Or if you were just just a robot sent out by a company to make me stream assets. But still, your vine boom was funny. That's it for now. Thanks everyone for hanging out in chat, all that good stuff. I hope that I brought you a modicum of enjoyment on your Tuesday night. Tomorrow is Wednesday. I believe that I'm playing Terraria with G Food. Um, yeah. But that's it for now. <sighs> good night, everyone. <laughs>